What's going on guys? Welcome back to UFC 4 and we're here with some ranked. Uh, normally we start with the comments and stuff, but today there wasn't too many comments. Um, you know, just some cool ones, you know, thanks, hi. Uh, we had like, use just jabs and straights more. Uh, watch some YouTubers like Martial Mind and stuff. A uh, man like Nathan said, try unbarring people. They struggle to get out of it and just panic. And uh, you're yours said, use the clinch. I know it's cheesy, but you win a lot more matches. And I don't know if I want to do that yet, guys. Uh, but at the minute, we are Division 8. And uh, this is the highest division I've ever been inside a UFC game. Uh, the weight class is strawweight women. Um, I'm pretty ass at this weight class. Uh, it rhymes for a reason. But fuck it. We're going to say screw it. We're going to get into a couple of games today. Um, and yeah, our goal probably within the next month or so is to break division 10. So we're going to see if we can do that. And um, I'm going to try and make these a bit more regular. So if I do include some comments, it's going to have to be... They're going to have to be... Um, added right away or they might or I might just do a video like this one where I don't have any comments in it but anyways let's jump into it as always we are hoping to avoid any rage from me uh you guys know how I can get but we're gonna hope we don't get that rage here today Ooh, okay we're gonna go for we're gonna mix up and go with one of my favorite strawweight fires I mean I do love Whaley oh do we go with Give ourselves... Oh, no. Hold on. One thing we said. We'll do random from now on. That was one thing we said. That avoids my... That pretty much gets rid of my stress, my anxiety, and my rage as much. Because I don't choose who I'm using. So I don't have a game plan going into the fight. And it helps me enjoy the game a lot more. So let's do it. Oh. Yoani on Jacek versus Yoani on Jacek. Let's do it. It's been a hot minute since I've played UFC 4, to be honest. It's been about two days, which is a lot for someone like me. Like, uh, good fight. Skip. Um, but yeah, so I'm looking forward to this. Uh, I've been playing a lot of the older games and uh, a bit of Madden as well, a bit of Rogue Company. But hopefully we can... What is going on with me? I can't seem to throw. No, don't kick in boxing range, you guys always say. You guys always say, do not kick in that boxing range, study. That's what you always say to me. I feel slower than her, but I could just be... I think I think I can. So the numbers continue. I think I can. Uh, total strikes have now landed for your yeah, block. That's pretty clean from me, actually. I have to say. Well, she's already connected on. Oh, got me there. Good stuff. I'm happy. That's all right. It's no big deal. Damn it. I'm just going to move. I'm just going to move. I didn't even mean to... There we go. Damn it. Don't want that. Don't want that either. I'm better than that. I'm better than this. I've got to stop throwing so many hooks. I've really got to stop throwing so many hooks. No. This is like my warm-up match. I haven't actually played a match, like I said, for a couple of days. 
Unless I can put her out here. I done it. Let's go with three seconds on the clock. That was terrible by me. But fuck it. We'll take that W all day. Good fight. Um, yeah, I had to beat her on the ground. Uh, but oh, I'm glad we won that because I did not want to lose my first game of the day. Bang. If she had fell a bit quicker, look. That's how slow she fell. I probably could have like fully TKO'd her, but unfortunately I just had a ground and pounder. Um, but you know, I'm not you I'm not spamming the clinch like people are probably thinking. So I'll fucking take it. You know, that's three title defenses. That puts us up to almost halfway into division eight. Let's hope we can get division nine here today, guys. Let's hope we can get division nine. She threw. Tons of strikes, man. So many straights. I literally slipped one and caught her with a hook. But I, at the start of the fight, she threw so many hooks. I was then consistently worried about leaning into the hooks. So it kind of spooked me to doing that. But I shouldn't be like that. I should just go into it. Anyways, let's go into the next fight. All right. As always, we'll go random here. This person has completed the career mode. I think that means they've completed go on easy. I believe that's what that means. Oh, have they got a creative fight they want to go with? You can go with a creative fight if you want, brother. You're going to go with Yoani and Jacek. Let's see who we get given. This could be... Oh, I'm going to need to close my curtain because the sun's starting to come and shine on my monitor, which throws me off. Uh, that's what we use as our excuse anyways. Let's hope there's no uh, no clinch spamming today because we obviously run into that a lot in ranks. Between Michelle okay. Watterson and Joanna I'm Gajic. happy with Michelle Watterson, to be honest. That's not a bad fire. Worst case scenario, I wait for a stamina to go and I wrestle her. Let's have a good fight. You ready? You ready? And everyone loves Joanna and Jacek in this weight class. But I like to try and mix it up. Touch gloves? No. No, I tried to go for the body shot, but right away we fucked it. But that's alright. I'm hitting. What am I hitting? I'm hitting my phone, for God's sake. Good stuff, Michelle. Fair play. Good clinch. Good Great clinch. To land that punch. I mean, I can clinch as well, you know. But I choose not to. If you want me to clinch, if you want to clinch, I will clinch, bitch. Yeah? Silly. Silly. Just over three minutes now to go. Oh, big left. Good stuff. She's she's throwing stuff of her own, a I suppose. Well job by her defensively yet again. You're not winning all the time when you're playing defense, but a nice job to raise the hands there. She keeps her hands up, keeps her chin down. Her opponent is not getting through to any of her head strikes. So just over 20 total strikes that have now landed for the karate hottie Michelle Waters. There's no tell on that leg kick. Punch over the top. Well, she continues to leave that head open, and she paid for it there. She's almost moving into the strike. She hasn't changed up her tempo, and she continues to keep her head on that center line. We'll see if she can make the proper adjustments here. Glancing right hand lands upstairs. Nice right hand there from Ioana Yeon Jacek. She's got that look in her eye tonight. That'll scare a lot of men, never mind women. I mean, the boogie woman, right? Doesn't she call you. herself the boogie woman? She's the boogie woman that's coming for you. And you see that she's back in that state that allowed her to become the longest reign strawweight champion you have here. Great tempo to her striking game tonight. She's oh, can't take pictures now. She has to react. And it's over! Let's go, baby! Come on! Precision with Waterson. I felt good in those stand-up exchanges. My head movement felt clean there. My head movement felt clean. I was happy with that, and she strafed into it. 
I could tell when I missed a shot and she hit me with one, I could tell that this cat, this person might not have been the most proficient in head movement because she didn't move her head until I caught her a few times with my head movement. Then she moved like four or five times in one go and I thought maybe this person doesn't have great head movement. Easy! Not easy, it was a good fight actually, but you know, I just like to yell things when I win. <laughs> As all, there's no disrespect to this fighter. Oh, we're going to try and get one more in today, guys. Try and break this Division 9. And, uh, yeah, I mean, I'll be very, I'll be a very happy man if we can break Division 9 in this, um, in this video. Because, like I said, like this, normally I'm like a Division 1 player. I'm normally absolute ass, But, uh, I'm happy to do this. What's the time? Two minutes left in this weight class, guys. If I were to wait two minutes, we could change, but we won't. We'll transition straight into this weight class and see what we get. What happens if I leave the match up? Does it count as a loss? Jiu-Jitsu Vanguard. Fuck it. He's got 2,000 points. I'm not quite sure how I can win this match up, but I'm not going to be negative about it. We're going to get into it. We're going to give it a fucking go. Coming up next, we determine the best strawweight on the planet. A matchup for the UFC women's so, 100. Division 20? All right. This is where... This is where people need to help me here. And this guy as well. If he ever happens to see this, please... Please help me. Any other, like, um... Prioxys as well. I hope he's... Oh, is this going to be a... Is this going to be a, a, a clinch fest? I think it's going to be... This might be a bit of a clinch cheese fest. Because that's what I heard a lot, a lot in Division 20. Is a lot of these... A lot of these... Some really grueling work here in the clinch. Both fighters really struggling to gain a dominant position. That happens whenever you understand the position. Both know exactly what they need to do. And when both fighters are trying to do the same thing, it's very, very difficult. Hold on. I should break that. I, I, I consistently just hold R2 in, in the clinch. It might not be the best bet, but it gets me out those cheesy-ass submissions, I tell ya. I stuffed that. So good, you can knee me in the body. You're not getting me with that though, I tell ya. There you go, she's probably going to go for it again. I'm pretty sure I stuffed that. Oh, that's a big hook to the chin. She's going back to that patented straight right hand, unable to connect. All right, so a nice shot there defensively to raise the guard and prevent any damage. Those hands never leave where they're supposed to be. And if you do that, most times you will block the shot that's incoming. Nice land there with the right punch. Easy to see why that is her weapon of choice. Great right hand. Nice land. Level change. Fair play. Probably going to fake loads of transitions now. Oh, her ground and pound is on point here. She's made this a focus going in to make these strikes count. Certainly doing that tonight. She's making each and every one of them. Okay, probably going to... Very, very good job. Of probably going to cheese me with some kind of hill hook here. I saw that coming, really, didn't I? All right, she's probably got me here. Because I'm not really proficient in these escapes. Um, so fair play to this guy. But I'm still going to give it a go. I'm not great with these. Damn it. Yeah, fair play. Yeah, fair play. I was going to have to give up here. I generally believe this person I could have beat. Um, I generally believe I probably could have beat this person. Had they not hit, I know that the uh, the joint things are really tough to beat, but you know, it is what it is, man. I'm not going to be mad about that. It's a Division 20 fighter. 
Uh, I generally did feel like I was better on the stand-up, and even in the clinch, I felt like I probably stopped her most of the time. She did a great job of level changing, getting into her opponent, not allowing her opponent to defend before she could secure her takedown. That was... That's all right. Fair play. Good win from that person. Uh, I can't imagine his stats would exactly be padded uh, after... Oh, they went up. Because I fought someone of such high caliber, maybe? I felt like I was probably winning that, to be honest. Um, I felt quite confident, really. Had I not tried to do them terrible transitions, I probably could have stayed alive until that second round. And, uh, and denied the heel hook. But fair play. It is what it is, man. I'm happy with that. I feel like we've done all right. But if you guys have enjoyed this one, be sure to leave a like. Don't forget to subscribe down below. Let's try and break Division 9 in the next episode. And I'll catch you all in the next one. Peace.